All right, what's up, everybody? Um, just wanted to go over the new update with you, and I'm sure everybody that's still playing Pokemon, like myself, that you are, you already know about the web, um, the, the new update. You obviously are already playing it, like me. Um, so I was literally at a park playing this, got the update, and uh, uh, figured it was going to be right then and there. So I saw all the new items that they put, uh, Pinat Berry, which gives you an extra um, candies from them when they when you when you catch them, and then uh, the the Nab Berry, uh, which like calms them down and everything like that, and then the the regular berry, the raspberry um, that you get, which uh, gives you a better opportunity to catch them. Um, basically, um, the new update's pretty good. I like the I like the new Pokemon. Um, the new attacks that they have, they updated the attacks by a lot. Um, Solar Beam, by, by examples, does 180 damage. It's insane. Now my Venusaur is just beast. Uh, they actually slowed down the attacks on, um, on some of the water Pokemon. My Blastoise was a beast, dude. He was fast. He was, when I did the water gun. Now they slowed it down and put it to 10, so now you're not basically spamming the um, button but you're actually um, you're they're a little slower so they're more defensive now they a lot they changed a lot of the attacks to be defensive rather than spamming everything um, but oh, a hydro pump too if they boosted up big time I think it's at 140 or maybe 120 now so which is really good um, my star a beast uh, um, Parasect's a beast now too if you have Solar Beam on him I got one that got Fury Cutter and Solar Beam so I think that thing's badass I'm gonna level that Parasect up um, but yeah uh, the Avatar uh, customization um, it's really good but they they charge like so much for um, yeah, I'm gonna go to it right here they charge so much for the um, the things. Oh, uh, just a quick thing. Um, the stuff that you see on the left um, on your screen, uh, that's me. Um, literally, I took a nap. I had, I had to go to work. I work night shifts, and I took a nap, and I had to go out and go play this at night. So the stuff that you see on the left is me jumping around my area right there, getting the new Pokemon, which I was it's like, you know, fuck sleep. I need to. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play now. And then um, stuff on the right that you see is uh, my mass evolution that I did, um, resolving the old Pokemon. And also with the new Pokemon, um, and you'll see just me scrolling through as you see here. And I'm just going to briefly talk about the other stuff too as well while these while these are going on. So um, yeah, I mean to get to to customize um, your dude is insane. So basically, what you do is um, go to your dude, right? Uh, this is my dude that I have, and. Um, click on the bottom right corner and go to style and then you'll see everything and then uh, it'll let you choose whatever you want and look at this 800 coins for a fucking hat man 800 coins so you're spending some people do that too but me I'm, I'm gonna buy incubators I'm gonna buy lucky eggs I'm gonna buy lure modules I'm gonna buy stuff that I need for the game, um, yeah, 800. I can buy 200 Pokeballs. 800. I can buy eight incense. 800. I can buy eight lucky eggs. 800. I can buy eight lure modules. 800. I can buy a bunch of incubators. I mean, bag upgrade, Pokemon starts upgrade. So 800 coins. If you think about it. You're spending in between. Uh, $4.99 and $9.99 on that. Now to some people that make uh, money off showing this, it's no problem, but to people that actually don't have a um, an opportunity to get that many, it's, it's ridiculous and they want to customize their avatars, it's insane. So either, to me, if, you up, if you're going to have that much coins on that, you need to update your um, gym holdage 
um, and not just rely on the ten because that's uh, that's too that's too less of a coin um, push out if you're gonna have having that much money on certain things that you want people um, to get in the game. I know it's money. I know that, but I you know just make it a easier opportunity for um, individuals that don't have that opportunity to customize so um, I know that you, you there's new awards that you can get um, second you start off anybody that's been collecting um, the the original ones like myself um, the new ones the baby Pokemon that they put out um, that that they're you'll get a the second you log in you'll get a you've collected five trophies yada yada in the beginning and then in the um, as you play and get more like me I think I have about 35 like I said or if I didn't say I have about 35 or 37 uh, new Pokemon and um, you'll get a another award saying that you collected 35 or 37 I'm sorry 30 uh, new Pokemon in the Johto region and um, so these are all the new ones I have I got Chikorita and then I saw him when I was walking around Bayleaf and then I can't wait to turn into the uh, Meg Meganum Megum that's how I say his name and then Cinerat and then I got let me just go this way because it's going to be crazy uh, Furet, Hoot Hoot uh, this is not Night any anymore so I figured since they put the night mechanics in the game um, that he was going to be a strict that night because in the actual game you can only catch him at night and it's not true I was actually playing um, at a different park the other day and um, he was out in the day I was like what the fuck is this I was like how's Hoot Hoot in, during the day and the whole thing was about the whole gold and silver type thing but no, uh, but I found him, so I'm good. Got knocked off, um, but but I'm gonna keep evolving, you know. Um, I got Crobat, dude's a beast. Check out this tech right here that he does for her. Air Slash, which is flying. Um, so I get a little bit of boost up there. It's 12, and then his uh, Shadow Ball. So they raise Shadow Ball, and it's it's a um, ghost, but it does a hundred. It's split in two and does a hundred each time so this dude's bumping out 200 um, attacks 200 um, base attack points um, I haven't got my toga chick yet I am literally at 41 I've been walking the shit out of Togepi um, I'm at 41 right now for him um, um, Sun Kern is the one that you need a, um, an item for and uh, most of them what I'm seeing is that uh, the grass type have something to do with that sun um, attack I mean sun item so um, let's see uh, the sunstone king's rock metal coat dragon scale and then your all other um, upgrades crap that you need um, unknown is in the game um, I haven't found one yet but I'm assuming that it's probably just going to be random um, I played at night played in the day nothing so I didn't see anything on um, on them um, being out on different times since that they put in the night mechanic stuff um, I saw more um, um, different genders so in the game it was you have to have in the when you Pokemon breed you have to go to the lady you give her two two Pokemon one male one female you give them to the lady and she breathes and then she hands you the egg and that's how you got um, uh, Pichu and so far, um, looking through all my Pokemon, all I see is uh, males for Pikachu, but I see other ones that are um, male and female. So I was trying to see if maybe then my 
my Magmar that I have because I haven't that's the only baby Pokemon that I haven't caught yet or finished catching I literally have all the baby Pokemon except for Magby so I was hoping that maybe if I can find a female Magmar a male Magmar that something happens so look at that Ember and Fire Blast 140 it's insane man boosted the shit out of them so um let's see I it won't let me choose on like it won't let me let me won't let me do anything. I can't produce or breed. I don't know how to do it. And it's not showing me how. Um uh, but um the different um oh shiny coat a uh, shiny um pokemon in here um there is uh going to be there i guess there was uh a mine for information on it and they found that there more coding has gone on to it so they're probably gonna do it later on um i think the only shiny pokemon in that game at the time was gyarados uh, it was the red Gyarados because I don't remember seeing any other Pokemon in there, in the DS version. I'm sorry, the DS version, in the um, Game Boy version, that there was just um, the red Gyarados. Um, new quick moves have been added. New charge moves have been added. Um, I mean, yeah, it's you. They're they're a beast, man. If you haven't started playing, playing, start playing. So um, it's just the only only shitty thing that is that. You have these beasts of a Pokemon, but your um, the the battle needs to be a little bit more, a little bit more difficult to me. Like I really think that the battle needs to be turn-based. So I don't know. I think it's still a good idea. Um, oh, um, um, let's see. Hold on. Going through the thing right here. Um, Um, catching. Now, um, when you catch it, there's an opportunity to um, catch them quicker, and you get bonus um, candies for it. So, like when you throw your Pokeball, you'll notice the ball just go, and it'll show like a like a little uh, like swift type of thing, and um, and you catch it in literally one throw. So they added a uh, like remember in the game where you like hold down B or hold down A and then you can um, catch the Pokemon um, easier that way and it catches them quick so they add it into the game so um, it's called Critical Catch and it's very cool um, you have uh, new movements in here too so uh, my, when I was trying to catch Exactu or uh, Noctowl they'll float up and just stay there in the air so if you have a shitty throw, you'll be able to catch them easier. Um, and they sidestep now. I was trying to catch a tentacle, and I went to the uh, to my right and um, moved it. And I was like, "Well, that's even easier." Because then, if I throw a curveball, it's just going to be, you know, it's going to bump it right in the head. Um, new music has been added to the um, to the game. Um, like right when you open the um, the screen. Uh, that's all you hear, and I love that sound, man. I can just listen to that music all day. Bring back um, good memories. Um, um, they uh, updated the launch speed of the game, so you quicker to upload to um, to get into the game real quick. And just a quick, uh, kind of like a side thing. Um, you know how they got rid of spinning Pokestops, and if you go over a certain speed, it disappears. But um, when you when you do that there's a gap there's like about five second gap because your your gps is reading how fast you're moving so forth right so there's about five to maybe about i want to say six seconds um where you can actually drive and and play so keep the game on when you come to a red light you'll load or do whatever and then there's like maybe a six second gap maybe and then you can do catch whatever you want 
and uh, it won't go away or you can spin the Pokestop and I've been doing that for for a while since that thing came out so you can you can still do it but it's not as good as it was um, during the day uh, back in the day but um, you can still do it but you know it's not, not as good so um, obviously they added all the new Pokemon uh, Silfro.com has updated all their maps with everything that you need for uh, finding them um, a lot of people are putting up old Pokemon Gen 1 and Gen 2 which is good um, so if you haven't caught your Gen 1 um, do it now uh, um, I'm already done as you saw in my old videos if anybody watched it I'm done catching mine um, but a lot of uh, um, Gen 2 are popping up as spawn points within my area which is really good it's shitty because I can't go out now because it's raining and I mean I still want to play but I um, it's raining pretty good so I'll still probably go out in the rain but I want to um, farm and get a bunch of uh, hit Tempe Town Lake and farm and get everything like usual um, but yeah that's that's pretty much it man um, I um, all the bandwagoners the bandwagoners are back I was at one of the parks and I've you know I'm still playing no matter what even though I'm already done catching all the Pokemon but I still need to level up but um, uh, I go to the during the day like for the last month or so or two that nobody um, was there like literally all the lures were like there was nothing and I'm the only one that would do lures and very few you'll see but this place was lit up they had so much lures going on I'm like oh here the bandwagoners return oh they so it's pretty nice oh uh, another quick thing um, pokemon.com has um, Pokemon Go Plus so I ordered mine um, before it went out and I'm looking at it right now um, today's Saturday uh, February 18th um, that it's in stock so um, it comes out to about thirty six dollars and um, um, I suggest getting it now it's funny because um, they add a limit to it so you can buy one um, per per purchase so you're literally um, you can't get more than one from what I'm seeing so let's do two let's see the product you selected can't be purchased at this time so I put two All right go back to one oh well I guess they sold out so let's see well no this is in stock so but I got mine um, and I paid $36 for it um, and then obviously if you've ever been to Pokemon.com and you spend over um, $50 in shipping for free so I ordered four Pokemon Sun and Moon packs which are cheap to $3.99 cheaper than going to Target um, so um, but yeah man if you do check it out um, go to Pokemon.com and um, get the get the Pokemon Go Plus um, also too just a um, big shout out to all the Pokemon players on YouTube that have been filming and still playing and doing what you're doing and all the bandwagoners returning um, all the bandwagoners returning on YouTube just go away man give it to the people that have been playing this and actually do it for what it is so I just want to say that and get that off my chest <clears throat> but alright guys I'm out hope you enjoyed the video hope you enjoyed what you saw and uh, keep playing Pokemon man be safe out there too so peace